Eli, okay. welcome. Yes. Wow. Do you have whiskey? Uh, yeah. You want some? Like yes, please. Yeah, yeah, I need a drink after this. <laughs> it is time to talk long term because peace has been restored for now. Woo! Well, let me say this: relative peace has been restored. relative peace. Obviously, <laughs> uh, in <laughs> the realm right. of fantasy, there's always something lurking Ooh. around corners and Ooh. stuff. The end of the world uh, is goblins there. attacking caravans, <laughs> etc. <clears throat> that kind of stuff. Piddly stuff we don't care uh, care about anymore. No, indeed. <clears throat> now, um, the next game will be taking place. This will sort of also begin our session zero discussions because it's relevant. Uh, our next game session will be taking place a hundred years after this. Which is a pretty long time. Evander is going to be dead. Huh? Yeah. Evander will be dead, but we'll talk about what Evander does before that. Because it's important. Yeah, okay. For, for final closure. Think about that. Um, I think Alchema might have an idea already what Wolfgar is going to be doing uh, after this. <laughs> So, so where are we after this? So give me a picture. All right. At this point, we're gonna we're gonna move forward a couple of weeks. You are in. You're back in Sartek City, or Appleshire if you prefer. Uh, it doesn't matter to me. Um, I I would imagine that I'm Sartek. You spend most of your time, Wolfgar, in Appleshire. Getting chewed out by the wife. Getting chewed by the wife. Yeah. <laughs> um, Everyone else being, being in Sartak City, you begin, you, you sort of meet again in the Sexy Badger Tavern, one of the places you first began your adventures. Um, peace has been restored. There's no more questing to do. Um, the Tinkerer actually joins you in, in this meeting. Um, there are some other folks as well. Kagan's there, Merrick's there, etc. Um, uh, I do want Sven. to. I do want to do one no. thing before we go here. Yeah. Um, just off by myself. Um, I want to cast augury about the thing we were discussing. Be more specific. Oh, uh, it will not go well. I don't even need to roll or anything? No. It won't work? Well, that, that's specifically what I'm asking. Will well. it work? Will it work? Huh. Uh... Yes, it will. But it won't go well. That's correct. Yeah. <laughs> you get the feeling that it will work, but it will not end well. <clears throat> but we'll okay. get to that. No, I'm just saying... You can do that if you want. But we'll I'm not going to be that mean. All right. What percentage of the population knew that we were doing this battle? Now? At this point? Or like before the... When when we did it. What population of the world knew we were doing it? Uh, what percentage? The word was sent out by the guild. So most of them. Like most you, people, like you the, are in now, the entire world? You are now international heroes. Like, you're right there next to Kagan. Yeah. Like, you are on the front page, Kagan's like, not even on the paper. Like, <laughs> parents are going to tell their children to just, to aspire to be like us when they We're going to have kids named after us. That's true. And likely. But, this is a meeting that was actually called by Kagan. And, um, he, he kind of brings it to order here. After the round of drinks is passed around, death Prefer answers. preferably not death dancers at first. <laughs> okay. like, he might see that and say, "Don't drink those yet. Just, just hold off." On I that. mean, I'll, I'll sit and sip and won't do anything <laughs> still because you're immune to poison. I know. <coughs> so always got, always got to mention it. <laughs> peace has been oh, returned for now. The number. Um, the Doomslayer so weapons. <laughs> The Doomslayer weapons are uh, have have been of exceptional use and shall now be retired. Agreed. 
And by that, do they I mean, all like touch and then vaporize? No. <laughs> um, Sven here will take them and protect them. If Put for, them away. If, if they're ever needed in the future. Hey, can I get a really sweet staff in this place? Like that plus three this. You mean the like staff of the, <laughs> the yeah sure staff of the archmage. <laughs> Look, at this point, yeah, whatever you want is fine. That's that's just the Elric <laughs> talking to Sven. Kagan, Kagan just says, put it on my Being tab. Being a greedy elf. <laughs> I got it. Whatever. The guild will cover any expenses you might have for the foreseeable future for you. Yeah. You have saved the world. I know. Uh, Imsh will hold Gullschwag until Imsh dies. Sven tilts his head at you. Really? It has to happen. <laughs> it's, it's, it's just Make a wisdom saving throw. <laughs> By the way, no. Sven is trying to it's magically. This is legacy. He has to die with the old swag. It's, just, it's what has you're to. You're not happen. raging, so you're not immune to this effect. No, I know not. But Imch has to. I know it's good. It's hard. No, it, he, has, it, it, he has to die with his weapon. And I can always distract him. He has to die with Gold Swag in his hand. I Gold Swag was his, his best friend. <laughs> I could pickpocket him. Gold Swag has served you well, but it's 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 time it's time to give it up. Right in the. Why do you always roll right in the crap? I don't know. This is there. Do it again. One. <laughs> Not one. <laughs> you you wouldn't have been able to succeed on the saving throw anyway. I know, but one is so thin. <laughs> <laughs> no. Uh, you hand, and you you feel no anger. No, from, it's not it's not anger from it's, from it's, the sword. You just hear so long, farewell, I'll be um, saying goodbye. Sven, of course, being as uh, the eccentric individual that he is. Um, you know, says thank you very much. I will protect them. They will go into a hidden place in my shop. Better be well, more well hidden than that iron flask of yours. That's that's never been stolen. To your knowledge. Seems like it should never be combined, unless it's Sven. There's a Tarask in there, isn't it? Point for good. <laughs> no one person should hold the two layers. His face. Is blank. Uh, there's no hint of of knowledge. I don't know what you're talking about. I know you don't. We all saw it. Imsh killed it. That's not true. Uh, he thinks he did. Harass. <laughs> one hit. Have you already been drinking too much. With my sword. I never drink too much. I'm a dwarf. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Anyway, <clears throat> so he he take he gathers up the dinosaur weapons. The Tinkerer takes the Biodrain gun from you, Evander, and is he he's he's the guy that built it. Oh right. yeah. Does he just like fuse it into his hand? He takes it apart. Oh. And says to Sven. He like takes um, a couple pieces from it. And he says can you destroy these? Because the biodrain gun is too powerful. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh it's god, too oh. powerful. <laughs> Bye <weapon>. voices. <laughs> yeah. To, to no. Remain. Yeah, I completely understand. I didn't want to even want to use it. I used a shotgun over it. <laughs> so yeah. Yeah. So, Sven does just straight up, no questions asked. Destroys. Like just grabs it. Some, <laughs> some, some parts of it. The rest of it is just like. It is clearly magical, like material, but it, it will never. You should fire make some again. guns out of those pieces. But the thinker is no, you shouldn't. That's how to make <laughs> never it. again. You just kill the thinker. Uh, <laughs> you're full of good ideas. This is why we're fighting <laughs> the By the way, oh, thank you. Said, that's you're what trying happens. to destroy this uh, weapon, and someone else on the The person that made it is still alive. That was you, great yet. And anything you need. I'm gonna live the rest of my life <laughs> building guns for. I want. I want to make this more you popular. Want <clears throat> I want gunslinging to be 
more popular. <laughs> you want to build one. guns for the gnomes? Yes. Okay. Yeah, I want to live out that life. And just I... Go to Gnome City and be like, I just I just want to live here and build. You can... So... And I also yeah. want to reclaim my, my lands, by the way, at the end of this. <laughs> just to finish off this uh, task of myself <laughs> from three years ago. Um, so, just to ask, would I have the ability to grant, like, lordships or, you know, dominion over certain aspects of Apple's Yarn? <clears throat> Two other dwarves. Yes. Two, yeah, I figured. They're all part of my clan, though. We well, are Well, Honor remembers, I realize that, but you don't want to go stir in that pot. That's fair. <clears throat> Other than we saved the world, that's a pretty good. Uh, we did. That's true. But well, you'll always have a place in me hold. Okay. All well, Kagan, Kagan says, um, if your land was taken from you, well, it's, it's yours again. <laughs> oh. <Probably>. Period. Boom. <laughs> <laughs> Let me just bit of check mark next to that one. <laughs> we will. We will take care of it. Cool. Uh, my character. You know, he's trying to figure yeah, out how to cure the dragon. That's part course. of my character. Story. Dragon sickness. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> Is there a way we could capture Tiamat and uh, turn him into a metallic? That's with right a here. That's right here. Yeah. yeah. We um, killed. So that. have I made a this cure for it yet? The though? first time we've ever. Uh, uh, you study it. You you come. Because you'll we have a, I, I know I've never talked about it. Are you full out? Uh, yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, great. You study... Absorb and that's what they say, at least 300. <laughs> like, I don't know how many years it's we're at. Appropriate. Oh, I put um, 397 okay, just when I was level 4. No, I, I realize that elves so. cannot be... Uh, don't die unless you're killed in battle. Yeah. So, you... Yeah. Uh, See, this is the first time we, Elric will still be alive when the next this campaign the starts. So that's cool. Yep. Uh, we're so we're well, the dragon sickness, fuck, yeah. but I'll be alive. The dragon sickness cure, and such. So, uh, <laughs> we'll talk about that more. Yeah, no. If you can just take <laughs> it away from me, if you yeah. want, like that's just the next campaign. That's all you. He's is. working on that. I like it. Uh, it might come in handy. Let me make a few notes here. Yeah. Um, how it works. On dragon sickness cure. Okay, Evander makes guns for the gnomes, and of course, I would imagine that at 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 your current state, you would also become an excellent uh, trainer. Or oh, trainer. oh, yeah, that's and such defaulting. <clears throat> Yeah, uh, I really wanted to become more popular. So if we ever are in this realm, there's more of that around. I really want to change the interface of what's around. Well, us. it it is becoming more more popular. Um, the gnomes are keeping a pretty tight tight gun control hmm. on it, Better than which is understandable. Which uh, I'm not a gnome, but they can see the possibility of that. And there uh, goes yeah. my arguments. The rest of my life, and I they're not <laughs> as. <laughs> Crazy strict on some of the like lesser type guns, like just standard pistols and stuff like that. But things like the antimatter rifle, oh, uh, and other powerful guns like that, they they're they're much more strict about. Like the rocket launcher. You have launcher. to register all. <laughs> all <laughs> guns There's a lot of people about that rocket launcher. That's gonna be you have to, my yeah. thing. You have to register all guns with. The but I am group anyway, behind my forward. study. In my office or wherever this is, there will be a rocket launcher built on the back of yeah. behind my. All right, own, uh, table. I dig it. I yeah. dig it. Yeah. Does Evander ever procreate? Oh, yes, yes he does. I figured he does. Yes. Okay, cool. Yes. Now you wish you wish spending a lot of time with gnomes. Do you, only, does he end up with a gnome? No, no, no. no. Okay, no. he likes the human ladies. Yeah, I uh, was just asking. Yeah. Or Elvin. I say elven or because I'm part. No, I'm just human. Yeah, so I'm just human. I'll with your human. renown, you're kind of like rock star status, so you can <coughs> do whatever you want, really. Oh. It Orc. happens a lot. Orc. Orc. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Correction. Uh, that was an accident. That was only one time, so it didn't count. That was only one time. Uh, <laughs> that was my sister. They're really good. You. <laughs> Overlaid. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, you could do Xanathar. Uh. 
Uh, well, no, I'm not even talking Xanathar. You can just do like a 50-50 every time you bang a woman, you get a kid. Let's see. Orc! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's a baby. Okay. Well, Needless okay. to say, you, yeah. you, you settle down and have a couple kids mm. while you're doing the gun and training and stuff. But you don't really adventure anymore because you've had enough. Yeah. You've s- you've seen enough craziness and death. I was a druid, and now I'm a gunslinger. <laughs> <laughs> I lived every life I ever wanted to live. I somehow forgot. That's, forgot that's, how to cast that's spells. True. That's true. <laughs> forgot on, how to cast on that D- on the D and D website, they're actually asking about a gunslinger right now. And I was telling them, I was like, we just finished a three year campaign where I was, and I put quotations. Something something happened. Was a druid, became a gunslinger. <laughs> long story, but. And I basically just said, I think a gunslinger class like this is really good because of how, like, it's all to you, really, and what weapons I can use and things like that, I feel like. Because the hand mm-hmm. rifle, because that wasn't part of That's the, in the DMG. That is in the DMG? Yeah, yeah. That's where he got it. But the guy named, like, yeah. the killer god double triple hell shit bullshit. Yeah. <laughs> Brutal. That was good. Yeah. That was but not, it is, it, it, that is now destroyed. Yeah. It is done. Well, it's destroyed for now until... Yeah, but uh, Imsh is going to forever search for a weapon that compares or is better to your swag and will never find it and be disappointed. But I'm not doing it. Is that cord? Oh, what's a, what's the lifespan of But he will bed any woman. Hmm? That's what's what's the lifespan of the half orc? He's a werebear. He's a werebear. He, uh, you live a pretty good life. He's going to search, search it's still gonna be for around a weapon for as comparable or better than your swag. And this, I don't, I don't. No, it'll be disappointed. I understand. No, no. <laughs> give me a uh, give me a percentile roll. Hey, can, okay. Final serendipity roll. Can I help him? Final ser- serendipity. I know roll. he's been looking for this. Well, no, no. It's not about the finding of the weapon. I'm, yeah. I'm. I want to see if Imp will still be alive. Oh yeah. For <laughs> for the next campaign. <laughs> for the next wait. Oh shit. King Whoa. Imp. Whoa. <laughs> King Imp. All right. <laughs> I don't want to become immortal. I wasn't even gonna go that hard. But damn. I'm, Oh, the bar- barbarian, uh, barbarian king, Imsh. We'll do green. green we'll okay. No green. Twenty nine. Oh, damn, green was bad. Twenty nine. Okay. Yeah, Imsh will unfortunately not be around. He will have passed by the coming of this. Uh, oh. Now, doubt, doubtful. Okay. That it happened Here's my battle. question to you: How does he die? There's a there's a cause of death table in Xanathar's. No, he he was. You have, a, you have a heart attack and too much sex. No, he was searching for ah. weapons. He was still. Did you fall down a hole? He... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's not a lot that can kill you. Yeah. Oh. Fall for a, falling from a great height would do it, though. I suppose like an entire mountain just falling on top of him would kill him. Yeah, it's like you find the weapon, you pick it up, it and it just causes a yeah, fucking <laughs> avalanche. <laughs> you go into a cave to, and pick up. You know what I mean? I mean, like it's. Sort of it can just be. I just got too old and died. No, you just walked around going, I'm this. too old for this shit. Imps doesn't retire. I'm a god. He's I'm a god. Uh, some sort of mysterious treasure buried in a tomb and he triggered a, a trap. Yeah. That's very you. And there you go. go. Searching searching so. for, thinking ah. that yeah, this is the one. This and, is the... And then the entire... Like, this is probably the after, you, of a, like, the after you've got, probably gotten pretty yeah. old. You hear in the that the sort of, of a great elven king is buried in this, this tomb, so you're with, searching with, for with, a, with an incredible... You go into the tomb of horrors by, <laughs> by yourself. And you trigger every trap. And die. I'm sure like Imps the tomb of horrors. No, he wouldn't. You don't need to run for that. And, and that's how you die. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. <laughs> you know, Somebody slaps you on the ass and you run through all the this traps. Yeah, it's going to be so hard style. not playing him. <laughs> it's going to be so hard. And uh, he's searching... The cuisine is going to break. I'm going to frame this character. Searching for a weapon like the old swag. Yeah. Alright. <clears throat> In the guild, this is to get to side. I have something to ask side specifically. So, about ten years after this, Kagan steps down and Siler becomes the guildmaster. He's a human with a, a magical blue eye because his eye was removed during the War of the Shard. Uh, <clears throat> he rules 
so to speak. He is the guild master for about 25, 30 years. Um, at which point he asks Sai if you want to become the guild master. Hey does Sai accept? And if he does, what does he do in the sort of 45-ish years before that happens? Oh, man. Okay. Spend some time so, with family. Yeah, obviously, it's like he, he wants to... Travel the world with your family? Uh, not necessarily. <laughs> so, I was thinking the immediate thing that he was probably going to do is kind of just forge, like, forge it on his own for a while. Just Go like just like away from like basically like pretty much like he like just drops off the map. No one knows where he is ex except for like rumors. That, like he just like massacred like this this whole like goblin like horde or something like that every so year. Just walk like, away from this battle, literally. Like yeah, it's like well, we get back and it's it's, it's it's a little bit later. I mean yeah. yeah, we get back and like so one day one day he's there. After that, then you just walk out. Then he's not. So you go on a walk about for a while, and yes. then okay. Um. Walk about. Got it. Um, he does. He does make contact uh, fairly with re relative frequency. Uh, stopping by different sexy badgers ac across the, the realm. Mm -hmm. Stop by so my place. Guess, yeah, probably once a couple times. Say hi, reminisce. It's a big grand reunion, and then well, he and then. Just as mysteriously as he arrives, he mysteriously that's disappears that's in the night. Really? Very, very Gandalf of you. Yeah, yeah just uh, kind of. He's there now. He's not. He's gonna. For a while. He's, um, you're gonna make him abduct yeah, some fucking hobbies. There's some halflings out there that are waiting to be abducted <laughs> by this strange elf. Ever. Okay. Was that? <laughs> um, <laughs> but that that. Okay. So how long does that last? The wandering. Probably about. 25 years or so. Okay. He's, he's going to spend a pretty decent <laughs> amount of time hanging out in the woods. Hang, hanging out in the woods and the mountains and the forests and the streams. Yada, yada, yada. Um, we'll say that there's some sort of emergency. <laughs> we all just eat pies. <laughs> Wait. That. We all eat like the Chabal pies that I picked up. What if you find yeah, some yeah, eggs to drink yeah. Okay. Okay. So there'll, be, there'll be some sort of event or like something because like, there's always something else yeah and this is because he never knew siler obviously like he's gone no. before siler comes to, and then he's gone while siler is getting his yeah his base started again <sighs> we'll say that siler like knowing of he's like okay first this is Where one is of the one at? of the, the penult penultimate Ooh, penumbra the agents. We it's like we we, need, we need this dude to come back to help for the, for this <laughs> task. Don't tell so, Bob. So you need to become a trainer. It's, it's, oh, that's Force Awakens. Yeah. Yeah. So okay. yeah. So he puts out the word to like yeah, all the sexy that's badgers, right. like tell Sai to come home. <laughs> okay. And then he okay. returns. Well, pretty much it's time to come in from the cold. Old, yeah, old spy reference. That's yeah. 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 Okay. Um. So you do that. Yep. We'll do that. So then, after a while, he convinces to. Convinces Sai to, yeah, we'll say, be a, be a trainer for, for Penumbra, Penumbra and, and work then, within. Okay, and then he has asked the question. Forty-five years after. So you would you would have probably been a trainer. So like twenty-five years, you would have have, have been a trainer around twenty years by this point. Yeah. Maybe if it takes you a while to get back, maybe like eighteen years. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> so it takes a while to get the word out. Yeah, yeah. Get to you. So we'll say that you've been a trainer for about eighteen years at this point, and We're whenever the question about. is asked, forty seconds. Uh, do you? I really got to uh, Do you want to be guild master, or are you willing to be guild master? We know you have the chops for it. You're gonna roll for this. It's okay if the answer is no, it's just going to be somebody else's. I rolled for it. And? Take it. Okay. Let's go take the job. And they'll still be alive for the next campaign, yep. too. He will. He will. Uh, you're, you're full L? I am S. Yeah, he's full L. So 
Maybe I've got hair. It was eleven. Eleven or higher was uh, was yes. Ten or lower, no. Okay, great. The memory is more um, nice. Twelve. That's great. So Sai is now the guild master, or will be whenever we start the campaign. That's cool. Um, the the, the <coughs> dagger. Up, my rap's quick. That was passed up along from. Kagan to, to Siler. Uh, yes. You do get that. That one is not locked away. Okay. Yes. Player that's dagger. yours. Yeah, because <laughs> that one, that one the stays in the hands of the Guildmaster. Because that's pretty much nobody the one that fucks with the Guildmaster. That's the stupidest thing you can do. <laughs> You're as dangerous as Kagan now. Yes. Yeah. I never if not Google more so. I mean, you literally spent 20 years or 25 years in the wilderness just only him. Just and surviving, lived. yeah. Just and not only that, and he, beast. Like his his mo mostly his goal was to just go right. out and do now, like crazy stuff. All right. Wait, this is probably the last episode. We yeah. are done. Well, what about yeah. my wrap up? Oh right, Ulfgar. Sorry. Come on now. I get something. It's gonna be a, a little bit long. Deals, so, a long yeah, session. Hang on. Cool. Ulfgar, you are high king. Tell the king has survived. Although it wouldn't matter if she didn't, because you can just cast True Res Resurrection. Yeah. And that's. She all wasn't about. in the fight. And good. I made that's sure true. of that. That's true. She wasn't. But I'm just saying, even if she wasn't, she did die. It well, doesn't really matter. Did she get. At your level. Did, do I have kids now? Uh, that's up to you. That was the whole. Well, I'm a king. I have to have heirs. Well, then I would imagine that over Ooh. time, yes, you do. What's your dwarf? You do acquire children. Yep. How, um, old you, when, how old were you when this game started? Hmm? Now. I was around. Let's, uh, let's talk about a little bit though. One seventy-five, two hundred. Because we're gonna we're gonna be shifting fully into my world's dynamics. Yeah. So dwarves in my world are basically like rock people. Um, oh yeah, kids. we need to. Oh, and uh, Schmitty. Schmitty, yes, Schmitty will. Schmitty lives in Appleshire. Uh, yeah. my brother. Schmitty will become. There's a, a death elf living with all these rocks. I, rock I, I will make a note of that. I need to take that into account. Actually, Is thank you. Is he a rock star? Years. Schmitty hey grows now, up you're to a rock be. Star. Come on now, he's living all these rumors. He's Schmitty. He's fleshy. He's got to be a rock star. I'm gonna leave that secret, and we'll see if he shows up in the next campaign. As I mean, a, he'll as an adult. He'll be, he'll be long lived. Individual. As an adult NPC. Yeah. He's a death elf, so yeah. Growing up with fucking all these sweet ass dwarves. Hey, what's Eisenschmidt do? Oh, he's That's back. right. Eisenschmidt was resurrected, like, so and he was... will likely go and live with uh, all these dwarves. Live with. <laughs> oh, I he'll... think so. He does like dwarven <laughs> women. Oh, he's going. Where be... else would he be? He will go and probably live in Albuquerque with Smitty. Yeah. So he will go that's really a fun. I dig it. I dig it. So ba he's just retiring. That that's all I'm doing. No. Okay. He's, he's what was your brother's name? Smithing. Um, I, I don't remember. Yeah, well, there it is. Your high party. Raising. That's, that's what I was just going for. You are high king. You have some kids. And I'm retiring from adventuring. Uh, you're I'm just going to rule. Here. Yeah, no more adventuring for you. You've it's like some, somebody comes in. I have people for that now. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> you, it's like, we need some help. There's a dragon. I got people. Y'all go deal with this shit. You absolutely You'll cast a gate every people. now and again. It's like, okay, <laughs> go. And the dwarven, every once in a while I'll sneak out and group. hit stuff with my hammer, but that's uh, it. The dwarven folk uh, do quite well because you have recovered Appleshnar and all of that fun business, so they are doing very, very well. You want me to percentile to see if I'm still alive when when we come back? Really uh, yeah. that was like 175. It's like a low percentage for you to not be because your dwarves live a good while. 82. Wow. Yeah, you're still alive. One on one, and then you're just dead. <laughs> <laughs> you actually walk outside and just fall. So, a couple of characters we know of will be will still be alive at this point. Sai, of course, being Guildmaster. Ulfgar being the High King of the Dwarves, and uh, Elric. Researching dragons. Being at the Mages College. Being Sartak City. Who he probably, the, would he retires be from, from adventuring. City on the uh, lake, you, you become a, a a sort of dean, if you will, like yeah. like a, a head a of one of the branches of the colleges. Um, the Sartak City one, if you want. Or what's the, the tower where 
city on the lake. Hmm? Tower where where America is. Yeah, what's that city called? Is, city on the uh, lake. That is city on the lake. Yeah. yeah that's what I thought. Yeah. So I'll be at those two places. Like I'll yeah, have well, a yeah. I mean, so, you, you can teleport back and forth. Yeah, also, no, I'll have with, a hold in both those places. With my but, kids, if they become NPCs, I want them to take Hoot Hoot with them. Aww. Okay, you passed on Hoot Hoot. Nice. Pass on Hoot Wait, so wait. The, what age did him stop? Uh, he was an old half orc warrior bear. You had great uh, for, how, you had great how, how old are you now? Twenty. 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 You're, you're, you're the youngest member of the party. Twenty six, I believe. Yeah, yeah, Twenty six. Okay. Too. So you probably I wanna be a god. I'm gonna kill it. I wanna be a god. I wanna live forever. Four for a half orc? You're living forever. For a half orc, you live a long time. Half orcs <laughs> don't frequently live very long because there's a lot of infighting and that sort of thing. He looks like an yeah, alien. I, I, would, I would definitely get to the end of that range. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So you live to be about 90 before really? you die. Uh, so yeah. you you will have been dead about 21, like, no, like 40 years before this came um, One last really thing. <laughs> I want to have a massive statue of all of us erected right outside Athelsnyar. We should, okay. we should Standing ones. over the dead body of Tiamat. Uh, we should mo- Mount Everest oh. style. <laughs> I like it. I like it a lot. Quarter. I dig it. Something dig big it. for the next campaign to find. Okay. I like that a lot. No, it's just like Raiders now, of the Lost Ark, but it's just the entrance of your that place. That concludes <laughs> the first Fate campaign. Yeah! Uh, three years coming. Almost made it to exactly three years. We started this in... No. It is about three years because we started this in January yeah. uh, of 2015. Hey, Next, that's crazy. Can I say what Lewis we is doing? Uh, sure, yeah. He would have started an orphanage in Sartex City. Okay. He was another fucking orphan. Which we're not allowed to have next yeah. time. <laughs> but he was a tiefling in Sartex City. He started an orphanage that, like, if there was any tieflings around, they usually... What is it called? Uh, I'll get you a name. Okay, cool. Give me a minute. No worries. We are going to end the stream. Uh, or in the recording, we yes. will still be streaming. We're going to do a little bit of session zero stuff. So. Break real yeah. quick and then do that. And, yeah, and then. Uh